your reputation precedes you, Garrett. Take it easy. yesterday. Smell funny and had no eyes. Oh, no. Not again. Is it over, Hi. then? Thank you, witches. Want to go to the port? Maybe there's some new sheep.
I owe you my life, unknown knight. How are you dubbed? Dubbed Geralt. Geralt of Rivia. My thanks, Sir Geralt. The Scallywags sought to demolish our herb garden, you see. I thought I shall take a hum, scare the rubble off, but to my great chagrin, there were too many and I, I failed. Ah, there's no use crying over spilt wine. Come with me to Vormentino. I'll patch up your armor or pound the anvil to fulfill some other need you might have. Fine. Lead the way. We are. Is there some way I might help you? Vineyard's glory days seem like a thing of the past. It seemed better times true. For bandits are not our only problem. Enormous yellow parasites, their ever-growing plague we also must contend with. Maid Matilda tries her best, but when folk fear to go out and work, what is she to do? What do you have? See you later. Slower.
Stay with me a bit longer, Lady Daphne. Gods be bumped, you must hang on, my lady. Come on.
smashed bones. Damn, it was strong. Come on, Roach. <laughs> That's it, Roach. note plus what I found earlier. Some third parties causing problems at the vineyards. Need to find the small letter mentions. And I'll find something mighty interesting behind whatever door this key opens.
Go, go. Master Witcher, have you any news? Coronado's and Vermentino's troubles didn't come out of nowhere. Found evidence someone was behind them. Specifically, someone planted Arcaspore bulbs around the properties. That's in these letters. As for who it was... What do you mean, who? Him! And only him! You're mad, woman! Surely you hatched this plot and now seek to stick me with the blame! Calm down, both of you. I'll find the place the letters mention. We'll clear this up. This vineyard, Belgard. Why is it so valuable? <laughs> you are not from here, it certainly shows. Before Count Crespi fell prey to the beast, Belgard belonged to him. As a man of wealth and influence, he guided it to immense success. Brought in rare grape varieties, hired skilled workers. I shan't trouble you with unnecessary details. Suffice to say that merging Belgard with another vineyard is a sure recipe for success. Take care now. That's it, Roach. Master.
Count Crespi's behind the sabotage at both vineyards. Gotta tell Matilda and Liam. Are there some more saplings? I need to join to cultivate something like this. I need to incinerate them before they spew spores and spread.
slow now. Whoa. Faster. Stocks and the whip await those running riot. Our duchy values peace and quiet. <laughs> Master Witchet, have you any news? One and the same man caused Coronada's and Vermentino's problems. Got proof. A certain Count Crespi. He's at the root of it all. What, Crespi? Belgard's erstwhile owner? Why, that's impossible. Got it all here, in writing. He did, indeed, have motive. He knew well his own vineyard could not survive if Vermentino and Coronata were to join forces. Probably why he incited the feud. Pulled it off, too, mostly. Just failed to bring his plan to completion when the beast got him. Incredible. You mean to say it... it wasn't Liam? And I was certain my troubles were Matilda's doing. <clears throat> In light of new evidence, uh, the most just resolution would be for both injured parties to share oversight of Belgard. Wait just a minute. Do you mean to suggest we're to cooperate? It's the optimal solution, yes. In terms of the health of the Enterprise as well? Hmm. I can't believe I'm saying this, but I do believe he's right. Perhaps it is time to bury the hatchet. Three vineyards are more than one. There's much to be gained. So be it. That's not all. The troubles at your vineyards? Solve them. You can go back to operating normally now. Splendid news. I'm relieved to see you hired a professional, especially one whose aid might still prove invaluable. But let's not get ahead of ourselves. Follow me. It's high time you saw Belgard. Witcher, come with us, please. Something tells me we'll have tasks for you yet. All right, let's go. into capable hands by no idle whim, for the vineyard's fallen upon hard times since its previous owner's demise. I've been told of workers dying on their rounds, monsters prowling about. Before anyone can call this home, they will have to deal with these uh, inconveniences. That is the minister's wish. More work for me, I guess. If you're willing, we'll gladly accept your help. I can help, sure, but I won't work for free. A bit less? A bit less? Is that out of the question? A bit less? Is fine. We have a deal. More or less already agreed, I guess. Oh, that's a weight off my chest, I must say. Your reward shall be fair, I promise. I'll get to work. <laughs> <laughs> 